The lands between is home to countless beasts and warriors of legend, but very few have proven to be quite as challenging as the infamous Laser Golem perched on the cliffs overlooking Kaelid. The truth behind this solitary golem and its unique powers and abilities have never been revealed until now. In this video, I aim to provide a plausible explanation for this gigantic yet silent guardian shrouded in mystery. In general, the lore surrounding the golems and their origins is incredibly scarce. The golem halberd states that it was crafted of black stone by a civilization now gone to ruin. The golem greatbow adds that it requires enormous strength just to draw, suggesting it was not designed for human use. Aside from armaments, the only other items to specifically reference the golems and hint at their origins are the crystal darts. These throwing knives were chiseled from impure crystal. Long ago, it is said that a golem crafter employed a similar crystal tool. It's likely that this golem crafter was from the aforementioned civilization that eventually fell to ruin, although many would jump to the conclusion that this is a direct reference to the city of Faramazula, this is unlikely their true origin and can simply be refuted by the fact that not a single golem can be found in the floating fortress. Despite the alleged similarities between Studio Ghibli's Castle in the Sky, this is also nothing more than a mere coincidence. It's much more likely that this ancient civilization, knowledgeable in both crystals and magic, were able to animate these stone beings with the sole purpose of serving as guardians. In some war, predating Merica's reign over the lands between, it's apparent that this civilization was outmatched and subsequently conquered, hence the various conditions we find the golems in. As we've witnessed countless times before, Merica was no stranger to recruiting outsiders to serve in her armies. The golems were no exception. Those that survived were repurposed to guard important locations such as the Divine Towers, while others were left to erode eternally as they awaited to fulfill a purpose that would never be realized. The Laser Golem was simply a near-perfectly preserved guardian equipped with mostly intact armor and a halberd that had not yet lost its magic. The extremely remote location accounts for this anomalous occurrence. In fact, careful observation reveals that there was once a bridge or massive ascending pathway that granted passage to and from the elevated plateaus of Eastern Kaelid and the areas we now know as the battlefield of Star Scourge Radon. When this passage was destroyed, the laser golem was stranded until the Inquisitive Tarnished discovered it years later. It's quite terrifying to imagine the sheer power of these beings in their prime considering the fact that the laser golem was simply one of many that happened to maintain its original power after all these years, not unlike the incredibly powerful warriors that can be found in the War Dead catacombs. And that's all for this video. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. It's a great way to let me know you want more content just like this. Until next time, it's the Inhuman One, signing out. Consider becoming a member for exclusive content, emojis, and more or become a patron for weekly behind-the-scenes content. Join the Inhuman community today.